Hello everyone, just topped up one of my squirrel feeders because we're going to be getting onto the squirrels soon. Just as I've topped it up, just thought I'll stick round here just for an hour maybe and just see if I can manage to get maybe one squirrel or so. So just going to sit and wait and see if I can get one. I didn't have to wait too long for the first one to appear. It's quite a distance away, probably about 45 to 50 yards. And it didn't seem to be staying still for me to actually get a shot onto it. But it is now making a move and I'm hoping it's coming towards the feeder, which it looks like it is. Looks like this one hasn't quite figured out how the feeder works, but fortunately I put a few peanuts just scattered about on top, just to try and attract them in, make it an easy option, and hopefully make that an easy shot. So we got one squirrel, took about 35 minutes of waiting, it's not too bad really. So next time I'm going to be here, I will be in my hide and I should be able to get quite a few in one go. But I'm happy with my one today. Well it's a few days later now, here I am, set up in my hide. I'm going to see if we can blast a few off the feeder. As you can see, it's very early morning, struggling for a bit of light coming into the woodland, but you can still see there is some squirrels which have come in very early. Not one, not two, but at least three squirrels in the area, so I'm struggling to decide which one do I follow here. But not one of them has actually gone to the feeder. However, there's one up the tree which looks like it's coming down. So I'm hoping I may get an opportunity with the one which is on top of the feeder. Picks up a peanut and now it's presenting itself nicely. and just watch them all score for after that shot. Sometimes you just spoil for choice. But after I just shot that one, one of them was actually still hanging around. So I gently and cautiously recock my rifle and hopefully I have another opportunity. That's two down, but I could just hear a little bit of commotion and there is still another squirrel which is still here, it has not run away. Obviously it doesn't sound too happy about it. So now it's got a higher vantage point. I've twisted myself to try and get myself lined up on this one because it is to my far left and at quite a high angle. But I line myself up and I get another one down.
So after getting those three in really quick succession, it went very quiet for a long time. So I decided just to quickly stretch my legs because it's really cold. Collect those three, put a few peanuts out on shore, then go get myself back into my hide. And a little robin redbreast decides just to help itself to some of the nuts. Fortunately, not long after getting back into my hide and retrieving all the other squirrels, another squirrel has finally come in. I was getting ready to give up at this point. This one doesn't quite seem sure how the feeder works. I'm hoping it's going to figure it out pretty soon. And that's what I like to see. So that's another morning done on the grey squirrels, managed to get just these four this morning. I was hoping for a little bit more but it was really quiet and extremely cold. Plus I got the other one from the other day so it makes five in total. Give it a little while and we'll try and get some more again. So if you like this squirrel video make sure you check out this squirrel video and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers for watching.